Okay. The second method is importing a standard steel profile. Go to Options, Complex Profiles, Import Standard Steel Profile. There are patterns from several countries. Here I choose Brazilian industry. There are many shapes, different profiles. Using rectangular hollow, for example, you can see the dimensions indicated in the figure as G1, G2, G3, and here in the list, the dimensions for each one. So I can choose one and click in Add Profile to the project. The file is added to be imported. I choose one more profile. Add Profile to the project and click Import. From now on, these profiles will be available to be used with Column 2 and Bin 2. So entering on Settings dialog in Column 2. Here in Segment, you can choose a complex profile. And here on the list, I see the imported profiles. Select one. I could override the surface as I want, I put up yellow paint, OK, I can insert the column. Using this profile, I can edit the element freely. So I can edit the stretch height, slanting. So here we have all the options available. Here I can can put it as, as a vertical column and then stretch height, slant. So there are many options for these objects. And as I said, I can use it with bin 2 in segment, complex profile. choosing the list, and then I can design the beam. Therefore, this is how you can work with standard profiles.